Uh, so, seven years ago, I said I was going to be doing a video on the mine events, and, uh, so yeah, we're going to be talking about the mine events today. I wonder what I've been doing in those past seven years. So, the Minabits were a band uh, that were led by an American singer uh, by the name of Rick James. You might have heard of him. Um, he was into a lot of drugs, so I've heard. I only say that because he seemed to have a lot of them in him at the time of his death, but that's unrelated. Uh, what I want to talk about is the time that Rick James and Neil Young were in a band together and were signed to Motown. Uh, so that's basically the Mine Bird story uh, in a nutshell. I don't know why whenever I say Mine Birds, I have to say it, the Mine Birds. I can't even intentionally do it, but it seems like every time I talk about the Mine Birds, I, am, I have some kind of nasal infection. So like when I did the video, I also was really sick, as I am somewhat to a degree right now, and... It's just a comical display of horrors. I wonder if that mug is going to come up at all. Anyway, so. Rick James starts a band. Well, why exactly does he start a band? Well, he's an American, you know. Uh, the band is signed to Motown, and that is one of the key components of the story. Uh, but the band is made up of Canadians. And why is that? Well, uh, Rick James, who was drafted, I believe, into the Navy, and um, this was like 1965-ish, he flees, goes to Canada, and starts a band. Uh, there's at least one story involved where I believe he's like a 15-year-old kid at this time, uh, very young. There's some kind of altercation, and it stopped by uh, leave on helm and I'm forgetting the other person and take him to a bar or some kind of form of meeting place and from there he ends up meeting some musicians and one thing leads to another the minor bed start people like Bruce Palmer join the band and Neil Young is not a founding member in any way. But I don't think he joins the band until early 66. And by that time, I think they were on Motown, or at least had put a single out. That single doesn't appear to be anywhere. I know it's not really on Spotify. And right now on Spotify, there's only five songs by the Minabids. I know this is very much a scattershot thing. But a lot of this conversation is, okay, 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 here's a little bit, here's a little bit, here's a little bit. Okay, they're on, they're on Motown, they record a single, It's My Time, uh, Go On and Cry as the B-side, A-side, B-side action, or maybe it's even in their mind to double A. Either way, uh, that doesn't get released, and I think around that same time, if not before that, there's another set of songs. I'll Wait Forever, and, uh, doo -doo -doo. I think it's I Got You in Your Soul or In My Soul, and that, I think, might have been recorded before It's My Time, but I do not really know. It's a song that is recorded, uh, and it is one of the main songs. It is one of the, like, five songs by them on Spotify, and it's actually pretty good. Uh, most of their songs... I enjoy, but they're all this very light, kind of mid-60s, not folkish, but like with this like almost renaissance fair likeness, like it's, it's the guitar sound more mandolin-y than like, it, it just seems like this angelic, poppy kind of, oh look how light and delicate this is. The drums are active, especially on a song like It's My Time, and, you know, Rick James is doing a pretty good uh, Mick Jagger impression uh, for Mick Jagger of that time period, but the material 
is not particularly there. Probably the best song is It's My Time, and I would specify the 66 version. Uh, the 67 version, which is also available on Spotify, does feature Rick James sounding more like Rick James. I Got You In My Soul, or I Got You In Your Soul, I'm forgetting, is a song that actually does have some oomph to it, some electric buzz. It's really, it sounds like a blues song. It's just, it's got a bunch. More than a lot of the other songs that they recorded did. However, it also sounds almost identical to a them song called Little Girl. So much so to where the song ends up getting pulled, that song is dropped. That single's dropped. And a lot of this story is... Okay. Uh, huh. Well, that's unfortunate. So, another unfortunate aspect is, at a certain point, I guess they realized their manager at the time uh, was stealing from them, so the band fires him, and uh, he then apparently reports Rick James, who is AWOL to the Navy, who then gets arrested. Neil Young and Bruce Palmer exit the band. The Minor Birds do kind of get it back together, I think, because there is a 67 recording of It's My Time, and I don't know if it's just that, but there's a lot of odd things. I think the manager ends up spending all of their money on drugs and dying is one version of the story that I've heard. Uh, there's not a lot of information. Uh, one of the best things that I had seen was in the Motown documentary was the fact that Neil Young is interviewed for a little bit of it because technically Neil Young was on Motown and I, I don't know, I just love that fact. Um, this is really just, I don't want to talk about whiskey for a little bit, so I'm talking about, um, the minor bits. It's not like an end-all be-all video. Uh, we're going to be returning to whiskey, I think. Uh, I didn't really announce what I was going to be doing at the end of the Tennessee whiskey video, but what I'm going to try and do is pump out a few more, like, the standard reviews and to see what you would like to see in terms of the untitled whiskey playlist thing that I'm doing. I'm thinking about moving into Irish whiskey for the next section, but if you have a better idea, comment below, let me know. Uh, if you like the Minor Birds, if you don't like the Minor Birds, if you don't like me and my stupid face, just know that I don't either. Just comment below. I don't... I... like the video I get I don't is this I don't am I supposed to do something now hey did you know Neil Young and Rick James were in a video Sorry, band. I'm very good at this.